Gord, if you want your Christmas display to look as great as this one here at Ontario Place, you want to pick the right lights. The new ones that have come out are called LEDs. There are 20,000 of those bulbs in the tree behind me, and today I put them to the test. Do you have enough bulbs? Every Christmas, Martin Lindsay and his brother Andrew really light up. For sure, it's Christmas is our favorite time of year. We've got 15,000 lights. We've got 36 dedicated outlets, 44,000 watts of power. The techno wizards put on a display like no other. You could say they're experts in holiday lighting. So when it comes to the new light-emitting diodes, or LEDs, Martin likes what he sees. Your regular incandescent ones, yes. The, uh, one of these bulbs here is 5 watts, and there's 25 bulbs on this set, meaning it's 125 watts for this whole set. This entire set here is 2 watts. They also consume 80 to 90 percent less energy, mm -hmm. which means you can plug a lot more lights into one outlet without any safety concerns. Perfect for the Christmas tree and for the durability yeah. test. Well, these bulbs are plastic, so the main thing is they're not going to break. Compared to the regular bulbs? Compared to the regular glass bulbs. All right, bulbs. let's put it to the test. All right. Okay. Ah! Wow. Now, some of the problems with LED lights are that it costs more in the short term, about double the price. And if you buy the larger bulbs, they don't shine as bright. See? The ones on the left here are LEDs. But these lights last a hundred times longer. So when the time is right, get ready to ring in the holidays. Four, three, two, one. Let, Let there, there be light! Well, believe it or not, the light show that you just saw is only half of the display at the Lindsay House. The rest will be done by December 1st. Live at Ontario Place, I'm Gian Lee. Now it's back to the newsroom. All right, G, thank you. The GTA is now home to one of the finest...